प्लीज क्लिक ऑन सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड क्लिक ऑन बेल आइकन फॉर मोर इंटरेस्टिंग अपडेट्स ऑन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग कॉन्सेप्ट इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू कंप्लीट डिटेल्स अबाउट द वन वे स्लैब सिस्टम एंड टू वे स्लैब सिस्टम ओके सो इनिशियली आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू द कॉन्सेप्ट विच आर रिलेटेड टू द वर्ट इज मीन बाई वन वे स्लैब सिस्टम एंड वॉट इज मीन बाई टू वे स्लैब सिस्टम सो आफ्टर दट आई विल एक्सप्लेन यू सम ऑफ द डिफरेंसेस बिटवीन द वन वे स्लैब सिस्टम एंड टू वे स्लैब सिस्टम ओके सो बेसिकली द वन वे स्लैब सिस्टम एंड टू टू वे स्लैब सिस्टम विल बी डिपेंड्स अपन द टू फैक्टर्स okay so in that first one is l by w ratio so in that first one is l by w ratio and second one is supporting conditions supporting condition is nothing but the supporting members okay so first one is uh, l by w ratio okay so the this is the first factor which is considered for the one way slab system and two way slab system so here in this respected l by w l is nothing but your respected length of the slab and w is nothing but the width of the slab okay so if you consider the one way slab system basically if the length by width the ratio is greater than or equal to 2 basically we will call it as one way slab system okay so here in this uh, two way slab system basically we will consider the length by width ratio less than or equal to 2 okay so if you consider this one way slab system the value of the length by width will be uh, greater than or equal to 2 in this respected system of two way slab system basically it is less than or equal less than not or equal to less than 2 okay so for example let us consider my slab is there which is consisting of 3 as well as your 6 where 6 is the length of the slab as well as 3 is the width of the slab so if you consider this respected dimensions so l by w equals to 6 by 3 which is equals to your respected two value okay so two value will be exist for this respected one way slab system why because this two value which is equals to or uh, greater than or equals to 2 value okay so here the length by uh, width value which is equals to 2 so it is obtained as one way slab system so in the same process you can consider the example which is consisting of the length of the slab is 8 and width of the slab is 5 so if you consider the length is 8 and divided by 5 which is equals to approximately value of 1.6 okay factor will be 1.6 so basically this will be comes under the less than 2 value equation so that's why the, this respected slab will be comes under your Two way slab system. Okay, so this is the first factor, and second factor is supporting condition or supporting member. Okay, so basically for the one way slab system, so the supporting member will be exist in opposite direction only. Okay, slab uh, exists in opposite direction only. Okay, where in case of this respected two way slab system, the supporting members will be exist for all the four sides. Okay, so let us consider. Just I am taking this respected uh, example of the one way slab system. So if you consider this respected uh, slab member, this is the slab member which is exist for this respected section. So the supporting member will be obtained in opposite directions only. Okay, this is the supporting member B, and this is the vertical column and the vertical. column okay so this is also the supporting member of the beam and this is the vertical column and vertical column okay the opposite direction members are supported for this respected slab system okay basically we will call it as one way slab system okay in the same process if the supporting member is exist for all the four sides let us consider this is the slab okay the supporting member will be exist for this respected beam sections here like this so which is consisting of vertical members of the column four like this so if you consider this respected point that is comes under your two way slab system okay so this is the major differences between your respected one way slab system and two way slab systems okay so due to the presence of the uh, opposite direction supporting members the load distribution will be takes place towards the shorter span okay basically i was consider this if i apply any kind of the loading condition on this respected existing slab system basically this slab will be bends like this in this direction again in this direction okay this is the supporting member okay so the slab will be bends like this in opposite uh, sorry in bends towards the shorter span why because this is a shorter span if i consider the bending will be obtained here like this okay so in the same process if you consider this respected section the slab will be bend in two directional condition system okay so the slab will be bend like this in this direction and in this direction in this direction and in this direction okay why because due to the presence of the respected loading condition and supporting member the slab will be bent but the intensity will not be higher value for this respected two way slab system why because it is consisting of the four kind of the supporting condition and supporting member due to the presence of that respected supporting member basically the values of the bending intensity will be less as compared to one way slab system okay so this is a supporting member and the next one is the perfect example for the one way slab system is sajja sand as well as your respected varandas 
okay if you consider any kind of the suggest or veranda section basically we will provide the opposite direction beams only okay due to that respected reason the one way slash systems will be considered here okay so the perfect example for this respected system of uh, two way slab system is normal slab system construction technology okay if you consider any one of the slab which is related to the g plus 1 building or g plus 2 building or g plus 3 building basically the slab member will be supported on the every side okay which is related to the all the four sides so basically we will consider here as normal slab system for this respected two way slab systems okay so till now we have discussed about the what do you mean by uh, one way slab system and what do you mean by two way slab system and what are the different types of the factors that will be affect on uh, differentiation between your one way slab system as well as two way slab system okay so now i will explain you how can we take the reinforcement values for the respected uh, one way slab system and two way slab system okay so basically as per the considerations one way slab system will be exist here like this and two way slab will be exist here like this so for example let us consider if i consider this respected as a one way slab system so basically we need to provide the crack bars towards the shorter span of the respected one way slab system so if you consider any one of the slab let us consider just i am drawing here like this so if i consider the length is uh, width, length is 6 meter and width is 3 meter basically we need to provide the vertical uh, member main reinforcement section as well as distribution reinforcement section okay so for that respected shorter span which is consisting of 3 meter so here we have to provide the uh, cracking bars crack bars like this for the one way slab system okay but the respected uh, uh, longer span will be consisting of straight bars only which is related to the main distribution reinforcement system okay so this is the reinforcement values for this respected one way slab system in the same process if you consider any one of the two way slab system let us consider here like this which is consisting of some x y value dimensions let us take so for this respected section of x and y value system basically the distribution bars will be consisting of cracked bars as well as your respected uh, main bars is also consisting of cracked bars okay due to the presence of the all the supporting condition we need to provide in horizontal direction for the cracked bars as well as we need to provide the cracked bars in your opposite direction only okay basically this is the major differences between the reinforcement section okay so this is the complete details about the one way slab system and two way slab system so that slab system will be depends upon the two factors which is related to the length by width of the building and supporting members condition system so if you take the one way slab system the values of the length by width will be uh, greater than or equal to 2 if you consider the two way slab system that will be less than 2 okay so if you consider the values let us consider example which is of 6 meter and 3 meter that will be comes under your one way slab system if you consider the 5 meter cross so, or uh, uh, 8 meter slab that will be comes under your respected two way slab system okay so if you consider the bending action the bending action will be takes towards the shorter span the bending action will be takes towards the all the sides due to the presence of the all support condition but the intensity will be less as compared to your respected one way slab system okay so the slab bends towards the shorter span and the slab bends in two directional space okay so the suggest as well as verandas will be comes under your respected one way slab system the respected uh, normal slab system which is related to the building construction process of 4g plus 1g plus 2 will be comes under uh, two way slab system okay so for the reinforcement values basically we need to provide the uh, cracking bars towards the shorter span for the one way slab system okay so again for this respected two way slab system due to the presence of the all the direction displacement values we need to provide the cracking bars towards the horizontal direction as well as vertical direction okay so if you have any queries about this respected differences between one way slab system and two way slab system please text me your questions in the below comment box i will try to give the answer for the respected questions thank you